Hi, I'm State Representative Mark Pocan, and welcome to my video blog. Uh, I've been doing a series of reviews about the state budget. And last night at about 3.30 this morning, actually I guess this morning, uh, we finished the budget in the assembly. Uh, the Republicans pretty much railroaded uh, the budget they had. And this budget uh, has been a severe attack on the middle class in Wisconsin. A uh, $1.6 billion cut to K-12 education, a half a billion dollar cut to health care, a $250 million cut to the UW system, 30% of the funding, the state share of the funding going to tech colleges where we're training workers right now, a $74 million hit to police and fire services across the state, uh, and a middle tax increase uh, on you, on Homestead and Earned Income Tax Credit. Uh, and while they did all these cuts in this budget, uh, somehow I found out they gave an awful lot of love to their corporate friends. In fact, uh, so much love as I looked at it, I was wondering if it, they got to second or third base uh, with that. Uh, in the end, we found in the next decade, uh, $2.3 billion of revenue will be lost uh, just because of the corporate tax cuts that are enacted in this budget. So almost an equal amount of cuts to actual new revenue going uh, just to corporations happen in this budget. Uh, the Republicans claim this is a balanced budget and has a surplus. Uh, over and over last night we debunked that. Uh, it's easy to have a surplus if you don't pay your bills. And clearly we didn't pay our bills. Uh, they have credit card spending and the hundreds of millions of dollars they pass off into future budgets and we're going to pay 89, uh, almost 90 million dollars in interest. This by any Malone. Uh, they raid funds. They said they weren't going to raid funds. They raided $411 million worth of funds. Uh, they did all sorts of other things that are just bad for this budget. Uh, and they passed a new corporate tax break that just in the next future budget will be close to a half a billion dollars, but as I said, 2.4 over the next decade. So uh, this budget was a real attack on middle class. I think it came out over and over as we debated the budget. Uh, they didn't accept our amendments, so it's pretty much the budget as the Republicans wrote it. And uh, it's at the Senate as I speak. The Senate's literally debating uh, that budget. So I assume by the time you see this, very likely it'll have passed both houses and be sent to the governor uh, to sign. Uh, all the more reason why, after we look at the historic attacks on workers in Wisconsin the last few months, uh, this historic attack on the middle class in this budget, that we need change. And I think it's something that hopefully uh, we can all work on in the coming months. Um, that's going to be the last uh, video in this series on the budget. But it's not going to be the last video blog. I'm going to have a lot of other subjects we're going to talk about. Next week we have a concealed and carry bill up in the assembly. And we're going to keep exposing what's going on at the Capitol. So keep posted. Uh, thanks for watching the blogs during the budget. And I look forward to talking to you again real soon. Thanks.